popular belief, there should be a third line on education. So your education should be a total of three, three spaces, right? Your education should also read GPA. Mm. Which some of you might, some of you guys might have scary GPAs, right? Mm. However, <laughs> Me. Your, your workaround over a scary GPA mm -hmm. is your major GPA. Your major GPA is almost always higher than your cumulative GPA, right? Because mm -hmm. it discounts the classes you took in English and computer science, and it only counts the classes that you took in business, right? So if you have a scary GPA, what you can do is you can put a major GPA. And I'd be willing to guarantee that even if some of you are messing with two 2.5s, your major GPA is probably going to be above a 3.0. Because your major GPA consists of business communication, this class, if you do well in this class, and also other classes like intro to human resources and stuff like that. So your major GPA will always be higher than your cumulative GPA. If your major GPA and your cumulative GPA are great, then put both. Because your major GPA is always going to be higher, regardless, even if you have a 3.5. Like for example, my cumulative GPA is a 3.5 and my major GPA is 4.0. It just makes perfect sense, right? Mm. But you're not being taught by a genius. It's just business. Mm. So 